Hey, Boxy here. I have some exciting update news for you today. It looks like we're getting a brand new toy shop and new toys. Before we jump into the video, if you want the chance to win a fly potion, just follow these three easy steps. Subscribe to the channel, give this video a big thumbs up, and comment your Roblox username down below. Winners of all my giveaways are announced in my YouTube community posts and in my Roblox group. Hey guys, today I'm celebrating. I've just reached 200,000 subscribers, yay! It was only three weeks ago when I reached 150,000 subscribers. I just want to thank you all so much for your support. I've also recently been accepted onto the Roblox Star program and the Adopt Me Influencer program. And all this change has happened in the last three weeks. To be honest, it's a bit all overwhelming. These programs are there to support YouTubers and will enable me to continue pushing out videos for you guys. Let me know in the comments down below if you'd like a video dedicated to these programs, what they mean and how to get on them. Ok, enough about me, let's take a look at the gift shop news. This video was released on AdoptMe's official Twitter page yesterday. What we can see is a new building made out of gifts with a train track going through it. On the left hand side of the video you can see the corner of a building. It didn't take long to figure out that this building is the car showroom. But that would mean that the current toy shop is either going to be moved somewhere else or replaced with this new building. As the building is made out of gifts, you may think that this building might be dedicated to gifts instead of toys. It wasn't until this video was just released by Adopt Me showing what the inside looks like. Here we can clearly see a load of toys. Let me slow it down for you. We can see a new Pogo, a load of teddies, some form of grappling gun, the unicycle which is slightly different to the current one we have in the existing toy shop, some roller skates with butterfly wings and a star balloon. How exciting is that? And this is only a small portion of the toy shop, there could very well be a load more items available that we can't see. So when is this update coming out? Well, they haven't released that information as of yet. But considering they've released a video of the toy shop in their test game and the new toys can be seen in the shop, I'd expect this to be available very soon. The Adopt Me team tend to release a lot of information on Monday, so I'd expect further information on the toy shop to be available then. As always, I'll keep you updated as things progress. I will certainly be buying everything within the current toy shop, just in case these items will leave the game when the new one arrives. There's not much in this shop, but some of the items are quite expensive, like the grappling hook at 2500 bucks and the propeller at 1200. In total, you'll need 4480 bucks to purchase one of everything if you too want to get these items in case they disappear. I wouldn't go panic buying just yet though, we may find that these items will be staying around after all. That's it for today, just a quick update video for you. This is The Box and as always thanks for watching and helping me reach 200,000 subscribers. You're the best. See you next time.